I am a psychonaut. A real psychonaut. Me, Raz. After dreaming about it all my life, I'm finally a psychonaut on an actual mission. Rescuing not just anybody, but the grand head of the psychonauts himself, Truman Zanotto, who just happens to be the father of my girlfriend. I mean, I think she's my girlfriend. There was that kiss, but it's not like we've had the talk or anything. But hey, she said it first. Darling? Didn't she? Rasputin, sweetie. Oh, Mia. Hello, darling. I just wanted to make sure that you were okay. Uh, yeah, I'm fine. And that you knew you were talking out loud. You could hear me? Just that last part, about Lily. <laughs> it's adorable, but we're trying to contact headquarters up here, and it's a little distracting. Gotcha. So embarrassing. This is Agents 9 and Vodello, hailing PNML-857. Come in, Mother Lord. Sorry, a little busy right now. No time for camp business. This is not camp business. This concerns the kidnapping. Give us the intel you've gathered so far, and we can help with the... Mother Lord, out! Unbelievable. Well, we'll just have to locate Truman on our own. I'll reach out now and see if I can pick anything up. It's often important to see the world from someone else's point of view. Especially when you're strapped to your seat. Hi, Lily. How you holding up? I'm so worried about my dad, Raz. Where is he? Why won't headquarters tell us what they know? We'll find him. I promise. Wow. So this is how Sasha sees the world. Well, not usually from so high in the air, but yes. Wow! I'm seeing the world from Mia's point of view. Yes, and you're quite welcome, but I'm trying to find Truman Zanotto right now, so please try to keep it done while you're in here, okay? Hey, how'd that squirrel get in here? Oh no. Did the squirrels get in here again? That's to be expected when you park a plane in the woods, darling. I told headquarters an underground hangar pays for itself in two years. Well, let's think of it as a mascot. Aha! I knew that suitcase was yours, Mia. Yes, but the good feelings belong to everyone. Yep, definitely Mia's. True psychic tales. This is what made me want to be a psychonaut in the first place. This should really be in a protective sleeve. What's that squirrel thinking? Stowing away on this jet. Devious little nut brain. That's my official psychonaut's uniform. Poor Lily. She must be really freaked out about her dad. So that's your book, Sasha? I never thought you were into aliens. Only in it for the science, Rasputin. Hey, I got one. What does a live squirrel in an overhead compartment have in common with a dead squirrel on the side of the road? Eh? Anyone? They're both carry-on. <laughs> you get it? Carry-on? <laughs> Ah, uh, airplane humor. Sorry, serious situation, I know. Pillows? This jet is all first class. Are you trying to hug me or something? Knock it off. That's not polite, Rasputin. Save your energy, Rasputin. Maybe that squirrel could give me some perspective. I suddenly feel a little nutty. 
Ah, uh, who asked you? Everybody knows squirrels have no sense of humor. Rasputin! Little fr- Hey, Rasputin! Think you could toss me a roll of toilet paper? Wow! This stuff is super light. Thanks for the reinforcements, son. Wow! This stuff is super- We're all out of TP in here! Hey, Lily. I didn't know you liked this kind of music. Uh, that's not mine. Hey! Get away from my stuff! Sorry, coach. Didn't think it was yours. It's high-energy music with a positive message, and it's perfect for my workout. I'm not ashamed. Stop burning stuff back When you really focus your thoughts, you sure can get a lot done. And break a lot of stuff. This plane really is fireproof. I don't think I can make this party any hotter. Raz, quit it. I know it's you. Thank you, Rasputin. But it's quite warm enough in here. Burning, already. Sasha, is rarely the solution to any problem. No way, am I wouldn't side blast Sasha. Hello, Steve. This jet is all. Red, you can. This has occupied. Find another one. Sorry. Hey, private, be private. I wouldn't side blast Sasha. I couldn't side blast. If we're anywhere near Truman, Mia should be able to sense it. I wonder why that one overhead compartment is locked and not the other. That's my dad's old music box. That's beautiful, Lily. It used to be my grandma's. What's a family heirloom doing locked up in the jet? No idea. But I'm glad it's here. You're lucky this thing's not- Are you trying, Lily? Have you tried using clairvoyance with your music box to make a connection with your dad? That was the first thing I did. But either I'm too freaked out or too involved, or the signal's locked, or he's, he's... Would you mind if I gave it a try? I'm... I'm getting something. Is it my father? Can you see him? No, not yet. Something is strange about this signal. Everyone. Focus your thoughts on Raz and Grand Head Zonato. Together we can connect them. Maury, will you help us? I'll cover you from here. This is where I do my best concentrating. I see something. It's a strange room. Look around for clues, Rasputin. If we can figure out where this room is, we can fly the jet straight there. On it. Raz, what's wrong? I can't. I can't seem to. Something's wrong with my powers. We may be very far away from Truman, darling, so your connection might not be strong enough. I don't think I could even light a match right now. My pyrokinesis is all out of whack. Okay, one of those symbols I know. And it's bad. These other symbols look a little... fishy. Hey, get out of the way. You're blocking the show. Oh, hey, what's wrong with me? Why can't I... Hmm. There seems to be... something dangerous here. What is it, Raz? Not sure. Something psychic and bad. I see Truman! Is he okay? He looks okay, but he's unconscious. Oh, Dad. I see some figures. Can you identify the kidnappers? No, they're wearing protective suits. Mm, curious. <laughs> Hey, this guy's not reading a textbook. Well, here's something. Oh, 
Okay. If I were a computer genius, what would I do? That's it. You found the location of the kidnapper's lair? No, I... Well, I'm not sure what I did. But I did something. Okay, that was the right code. This one looks like the Button Master. So, this is how it feels to be the Button Master. I wonder if this opens that big window. Come on, open up! Okay, I open the hatch, and... Oh, it's full of... Ugh. What's wrong, darling? Nothing. Just got a little dizzy for a second. There's some sort of glowing yellow rock in here. Rasputin. Was there a psychohazard symbol on the outside of the container you just opened? Oh, yeah. I was gonna mention that. Silerium. Be careful, Raz. It's very psychically disorienting. And Silerium is also incredibly rare. That certainly narrows down the possible locations. But we still need more information, Rasputin. Gotcha. This one must be the computer genius. I wonder if this opens that big window. There's a big window here, but it's shut. If only we could look outside, we might be able to see some sort of landmark. A building or some regional foliage. Hmm. What is this place? Hmm. Who would even do that? I guess the suits protect you from some sort of psychohazard. Guess that's it. What the heck? What is it? It's the emblem for the psychonauts. What? Could this be one of our unused facilities? That's a very important clue, Rasputin. You've narrowed down the location significantly. Keep looking around, Raz. <laughs> This thing adjusts to the height of the torturer, I guess. Creepy. <laughs> Sorry. Hey! This guy's in charge of the big ball. This one's really interested in buttons, it seems. They've got just that... water? Uh, Are they using water torture? No. Water outside of the window. Guys, we're underwater. Under a lot of it. Underwater? <gasps> Sasha! An underwater psychonaut facility. With a large supply of Silerium. Only one place I know fits that description, but it's been shuttered for years. Exactly. What? Do you know where my dad is? Is he safe? I think we know where he is, darling. But it's definitely not safe. Rasputin, we're leaving. Regather your thoughts carefully, Rasputin, so you don't get Silerium sickness. Roger that. We're coming for you, Dad! Oh, Lily. Papa? Lily, stay away. Don't come here. It's not safe. Papa! Something's not right. This isn't good. Ugh. Rasputin! Darling, can you hear me? 
Rasputin, are you with us? How many fingers am I thinking about? Um, purple? Close enough. You did it, Raz. You found out where my dad is. Outpost Charlie Psycho Delta, the only underwater psychonaut research facility built for studying Silurium. And it's right in the middle of the Rhombus of Ruin. A region of the ocean noted for the numerous planes and ships that supposedly went missing there, as well as its four equilateral sides. Truman told me not to go there. Not safe. Those legends were made up by the Psychonauts to scare people away from our facility years ago. We've actually been flying toward the Rhombus for hours while you slept. As a matter of fact, we should be there right about... Now, we flew into the deadly parallelogram? Sputin, please! A parallelogram sides are not necessarily equal. Warning! Psychonav systems compromised. We all need to focus on protecting the ship's control. Too late. We need to focus on fastening our seatbelts. Warning! Catastrophic altitude loss. Ah! Looks like a little turbulence to get the valves moving. All right! Why is the ocean coming at us? Sasha, Mia, can you hear me? Where are they? I have to get out of here. Hmm. What's down here? I really got to get out of this room. I really want to get my body out of that torture chair. This one looks like the button mask. Hey, you! Hmm. What's this guy doing? doesn't seem to be working. Rats. Yeah, you. I don't think I could even light a match right now. 
My pyrokinesis is all out of whack. Why do you kidnap Truman? Here we go. What the? Wow! That's incredible! Hi, Fishy! So this is what it's like to be underwater. Hey, the door's closing. I'm stuck out here. Oh, that's right. I'm not really out here. I wonder where the jet is. Did it sink down to the bottom? Are the others inside? I've got to get down there and find them. I'm usually terrified of water, but since I'm only doing it mentally, I can actually enjoy it for once. There was an issue of true psychic tales that talked about the rhombus of ruin, but I assumed it was just a legend. But it looks pretty real to me. According to True Psychic Tales, issue 43, the heart of the rhombus of ruin is an enormous silerium deposit. So powerful it can confuse and attract the minds of pilots and captains for miles and miles, like a deadly mental magnet. The Psychonauts tried to set up research stations like this one to study it, but no one could bear the Silerium mental effects. Did not expect to see one of these here. <laughs> wow! Look at all that Silerium glow! Look at all these vehicles! So many vehicles. Guided here by what? Silerium poisoning? Psychomagnetism? I mean, I just made that term up. But it sounds as right as anything. I can feel it now. Twisting my mind. I wonder how it's affecting the others. Okay. Mid-mission status report. Plane crashed. Team separated. I'm tied to a chair. Psi powers not working. Weird silent guards everywhere. I'm gonna put those in the challenges column. Under opportunities, not dead yet. Some power's still working. And I'm learning a lot about fish. I just need to find Lily and Sasha and Mia soon. Oh, and Coach, him too. I've got to get down there and find them. Hmm. Not much of a view from down here. I wonder... Open and reveal your kidnapped psychonauts. Hey, anybody in there? Maybe that fell off a boat? Huh. I thought jellyfish didn't have brains. Guess this is one of the smart ones. Hmm. Not much of a view from down here. Don't explode, don't explode, don't explode! Ah, much better view. Although I feel a little bloated. Wow! Look at that Silerium deposit. Where did it come from? And why does it look so much like a brain? Ew. I hope the kids got off before this bus sank. That's one big ship. Looks like a train engine. Wonder where the rest of it is. Choo-choo! Choo-choo! Looks like a switch for the train track. Can't side blast anything with my head all messed up like this. I need to save the children. Mia! What are you doing? It's like she's in some sort of trance. Mia! 
Can you hear me? I can't talk now, Rasputin. This bus is caught on the tracks and it's taking all my strength to hold back this train. I need to save the children. Oh, man. I think that might fry my brain. Hey, eel! Yikes. I'm glad my body's not here with me. Those sharks look really hungry. I can't summon enough energy to move it. It's no good. Hi, Sparky. Bzz, bzz, to you too. Won't budge. Not strong enough. Can't I don't think I can do hold it. this for much longer. Choo choo! I can't summon enough energy to move it. Choo choo! Ooh, that makes my brain tingle a little. Who's a cute little man eater? Hey, eel! Hi, Sparky. It's no good. Won't budge. Choo choo! I the children. Mia, I need your help to find the other Psychonauts. I need to save these orphans first. Orphans? Hey, there's the engine. I'd try to get it started, but I don't think driving out of here is very likely. Bzz, bzz, to you too. Looks like the battery's out of juice. Ooh, that makes my brain tingle a little. Okay, you... Hey, eel! Stop! Resume swimming. Hi, Sparky. Hey, where'd that eel go? Guess he didn't want to show his face after the battery sucked all the juice out of him. But I still need more power. We got some power, but not much. Freeze! Hey, lights! Now we're cooking. Battery looks half full. I'll bet the manual for that battery specifically states, do not submerge battery in seawater for years. As you were. Red light, we're full up. I don't want to let that eel out. He's still got some juice left. And he'll probably be mad. Hello? Hello? Sasha! Is anyone there? How is he on the radio? Why do I think they'll understand my Earthling language? Or are they so advanced they can understand any language? We know so little. Anything is possible. We are so insignificant. Why would they We're even full up. talking to us? You're Steve free to go. Must try. This is historic. What does Stop. this dial do? Can't get a connection. Does this change anything? Move along. Testing, testing. This is Sasha Dye from planet Earth. We have found one Choo -choo. of your vehicles. Okay, you can go. No one aboard survived. Hmm. I hadn't considered their reaction hey, to buddy. the loss of their vehicle and its crew. I need something what to break me out of this trash. What if they blame me? Have I just summoned Could the a vastly superior species? What choice do I, I don't want to let that eel out. He's still history. got some juice left. And he'll destiny. probably be mad. Even if that destiny is our destruction, this is Can't side blast life. anything with my what head all messed up like this. But the truths we have collectively discovered, painful though they were to learn, I must press on. I must break through. Hello. Resume swimming. Tickle tickle. Can't get a connection. My name is Sasha Nine, and I am a cute little man. In the name of science. Do choo choo. What you may. Hello. 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 Oh wow. There? Mia. Why do I? You think, think those weird guards are little language. children? I can't or fail the so orphans again, Rasputin. Any language. I wonder if one of these guards Anything knows something. Are so insignificant. Why would they? Ah oh, man, Mia would love this song. Can't side blast anything with my head all messed up like this. Huh? The buttons don't work on my radio. Is Sasha Nine from Planet I don't Earth. think I can we hold this for much longer. Vehicles. Unfortunately, no one aboard survived. Hmm. Rasputin, where are you? Who are these people? Mia, 
We were in a plane crash. I'm in the research outpost. I think those guards work for Truman's kidnappers. And our kidnappers too, it seems. Are you with the others? No. We have to go find them. Of course, but I don't think I can do much of anything right now, Rasputin. Something's wrong. Something's wrong with me. It's the Silerium. It's messing up our brains. But I think I can resist it. Mori always said your brain was armored like a tank. I think the best way for me to help is to focus my psychic energy on you, young man. I focus on boosting your telekinetic ability, just in case you run into any more runaway trains. But I can't do it alone, Mia. You won't be alone, darling. I'll be in your thoughts, listening to everything you think. Yikes. Hmm. Now that I have my TK back, what should I try to lift first? The light's on in that bomber over there. <laughs> Be right back, Mia. I'm gonna go check out this bomber. I will send my thoughts with you, young man. There's a guard here. I'm in. Great work, <laughs> darling. Boop. Take that, fish. <laughs> Take that, fish. <laughs> Can't side blast anything with my head all messed up like this. <laughs> Twelfth Airborne Flying Rats. Give them the old one-two. Wow. That's a big bomb. This with seawater must have neutralized these bombs, right? Lily! Francis the Frog in the sun. When she gets hot, we'll have some fun. Uh-oh. Lily looks as out of it as, well... As I was? Yeah. It's all right, darling. I was in a bad way, thanks to the Silerium. Let's try to help her like you helped me. Roses are red, ready to bloom. These things make me really nervous. Wow, that's a big bomb. The seawater must have neutralized these bombs, right? These things make me really nervous. Gentle. Careful now. I don't think I could even light a match right now. My pyrokinesis is all out of whack. Wow. That's a big bomb. What's so fang? <laughs> The seawater must have neutralized these bombs, right? These things make me really nervous. Bang! <laughs> oh man, are those fleas? 
Yuck. Stale. Wait a second. Oh, hi, Raz. Welcome to my garden. Lily, you have to stop what you're doing. These aren't flowers. These are... Shh. Raz, quiet. Plants are very sensitive to psychic energy. I won't have you upsetting them. Oh, man. Wow, that's a big bomb. Can't side blast anything with my head all messed up like this. Easy does it. I think I should leave it for the rat. Hey, Lily dropped her music box. Looks a little damaged. It used to sing about my father, but then it stopped. Huh. There's a hole in the side of Lily's music box. Better be careful. This thing's already pretty damaged. Not me. I'm fine. Slow and steady. Beat it, dear. Thanks, Raz. But that garden net will keep them out. They love me. They love me not. They love me. They love me not. Yuck, what am I doing? Water must have neutralized these bombs, right? <laughs> Can't side blast anything with my head all messed up like this. I can't side blast anything with my head all messed up like this. Roses are red, ready to bloom. Explosions of color. Sorry. Leave Harold alone. Got one. Hope you like music, Flea. Wow. It looks so small from the outside. Can't side blast anything with my head all messed up like this. Let's get this out of there. This has got to go. Ah, like music to my ears. Well, not like music but actually music. Hey, did you guys hear that? It sounds like, like, like. Hey, you guys lied to me. You're not flowers, none of you. Where's the jet? Where is everybody? Well, what's that light up there? Could be one of the others. Oh, I gotta get out of here! Harold, you stay put. I'll come back for you when it's safe. Out of my way, creep! Or you are literally 
Harold, meet the real Lily Zanato. What's wrong with you? I thought she was done, Miss. Lily, it's me! Raz, where are you? I'm with your father. Where's everybody else? I'm here too, darling, in a school bus nearby. I was sick with Silerium poisoning, just like you. Silerium? Oh, that must be why I can't lift anything. I'm trying to pile enough bombs here to blow this hat. Is that safe? There's a train connected to the outside of this wall. If I can get through this door, I can get inside. And go where? Away from this place where all the bombs are. Good point. Okay, I'll make a bomb pile, but you should find a safe place to hide. Yeah, yeah. Come on. These things make me really nervous. Wow. That's a big bomb. This shouldn't be so hokey. That's enough big ones. Now I need some little ones that aren't so hard to heat up. Bring me a little bomb to use as kindling. Bring me Francis. Where's that little bomb Lily was talking to? The one she was hitting with a hammer. Where's that little bomb Lily was talking to? The one she was hitting with a hammer. Mm, that one's no good. Keep trying. Come on, Francis. Here we go, little buddy. That's good. Any more, and we'll split this plane. Okay, Raz, wherever you are, plug your ears. Please be careful with fire, darling. Francis, I accept you for what you are. Now, show me what you got. <laughs> I knew she was talking to the rat. I'm sorry, darling. Um, excuse us for barging into your mind like this, Lily. Uh... Hello again, sweetheart. Oh, Raz! Mia! Glad you're here. Listen. With the Silerium poisoning, I'm going to need a little help getting through this train. If I focus what's left of my Psy energy on you, Raz, it should give you enough extra power to cover me with pyrokinesis. But you gotta get out of here so I can concentrate, okay? Sounds good. I think she means out of her mind, darling. Oh, right, of course. <laughs> Let's get out of here! Yes, I feel the fire in my belly again. The belly of my mind. I don't think I could even light a match right now. <laughs> my pyrokinesis is all out of whack. Come on! Won't but I can't side blast anything with my head all messed up like uh, this. Won't budge. Lock this door, a uh, moose. Ah, uh, yeah. Good job, Raz. We gotta get through this train. Uh, <laughs> hmm. Fireproof window Dad, shades. Can you see any Stylish of the and. Side? I can't side blast anything with my head all messed up like this. Open up! Oh! I would never want to start a pyro war with Lily. Yeah. Also, I, I don't think that would help the mission. That's probably where they're holding the others. Uh oh, there's a guard in the next car, and he's got some sort of cattle prod. That is messed up. Raz, see if you can get rid of him. You 
can warm these guys up, but they never seem to cook all the way. Are you talking about frozen casseroles, darling? Make sure you rotate the dish. Okay, so I'm a creepy guard with a cattle prod. Excuse me, I'm a hungry creepy guard with a cattle prod. Now what? Open up! Ho ho! What's this? I have a feeling this is gonna be delicious. Ah, it's still alive! Still looks pretty delicious, though. This isn't good. This door's not going to hold. I'd better hide. Great idea, Raz. Let's put a few more in there to be sure. Ugh. These things are heavy. Sorting baggage. I actually have some experience with this. Man, no good. Solid steel. Exactly what I would have done if it weren't for this stupid Silurium. How about this? Maybe this opens up a path. Maybe this goes over here. Keep clearing a path, Raz. We gotta get through this. If I move Almost this over there, here, Raz. maybe this opens up a path. How about this? Keep clearing a path, Raz. We gotta get through this. Gotta move this one. How are people supposed to get through here? This is a Maybe Something. this goes over here. Keep going, Raz. Step by step. Maybe Careful. this opens up a path. Precious cargo here. Almost there, Raz. Keep clearing a path, Raz. We gotta get through this. If I move this over here... Hmm. Almost there, Raz. If I move this over here... Gotta move this one. Keep clearing a path, Raz. We gotta hmm. get through this. If 
I move this over here... Almost there, Raz. Hmm. Maybe this goes over here. Hmm. Hmm. Maybe yeah, this goes over we're here. Cooking. How about this? Well, that's something. If I move this over here, gotta move this one. They look pretty solid. Hmm. Maybe this opens up a path. Hmm. Maybe this goes over here. Maybe this opens up a path. Hey! I'm standing here! Almost there, Raz. Keep clearing a path, Raz. If I you move this over through. here... Maybe this opens up a path. Hmm. You try to squish Maybe me? this goes over here. How about Keep this? Clearing a path, Raz. We gotta get through this. Almost there, Raz. He's all clear. Great job, Raz. To the caboose. Looks like I'm not going to get any farther physically and psychically. I'm still pretty scrambled. I'm going to stay here and keep focusing my psi energy on you, Raz. Harold. Okay, Harold, what are we looking at? Aha! It is a candle. I knew it. Uh-oh. Busted. Be cool, Harold. Be cool. Did you bite him, Harold? I said be cool. Oh, great, now he's really, really... A fish? What the heck? Raz, what are you talking about? These guards are all fish. Are you seriously just figuring that out? I always thought these guys seemed a little... Oh, I was going to say suspicious, but that's a better joke. <laughs> okay. Now I just have to remember all that submarine instrument training I took. Oh, wait. That was just a comic book I read. But still... Let's see if I can move this thing. Hey, I think the periscope is poking into another vessel. Why do I think to understand my Earthling language? And so that's why, on my planet, we have artificial butter. Now, you tell me something about your planet. Agent Nine! Are you okay, darling? Sasha, we're in big trouble. Relax, all of you. Everything's fine now. What? I was worried, too, when I thought that the alien crew had perished in the crash. But look at all the survivors I found. Sasha, you have Silurium poisoning. She means aliens. Well, th they aren't a lot of things. It's good to be skeptical, children, but sometimes science needs to be open-minded. We are on an alien vessel. Do you understand the consequences? The boon to science? Oh, brother. Now, let me get back to my historic encounter, will you? <laughs> Oh, 
they so advanced they can understand any language. Where did these guys come from? This rotating platter seems to drive the star display. We are so insignificant. Why would they even bother talking to us? Still Can't sideblast anything with my head all historic. messed up like this. These controls all seem to be under lockdown. I wonder what they do. Probably something weird and alien. Don't touch them, Raz. This is Sasha 9 from planet Earth. Oh man, I'm still not used to these fish face freaks. Put your head. Does Silerian cause this kind of mutation? Vehicles. I don't think I could shake him out of this. I need to find music. <gasps> what if I don't think I could shake him crash? out of this. I need to find music. I wonder if there's some music on that what gold record that would help Sasha. Have I just seen the wrath of a vastly superior species? This is obviously where the aliens store their snow cone flavor syrup. The left tube fluid really looks like it's too high. For what, I'm not sure. What choice did Let's I have see in what the face of scientific history? Aha! It's doing something upwardly. Even if that Sasha, does that rightmost fluid tube thing with a little high view? This is for the good of science. And what value Center is that to fluid humanity? Is definitely but the truth we have collectively discovered, painful though they were to learn. I must press on. I must break through. Looks like the reactor core is stabilized now. Or the snow cone flavors are My mixed well. Either way, it's a win. And I have come in peace in the name of science. I hope this isn't permanent. Hmm. What do you want from us? Do with us what you may. Hello? Can't side blast anything with my head all messed up like this. This seems kind of neat now that I can see their faces. Better not burn this hay. Might need it for an experiment. There's some sort of force field blocking the way. I wonder if playing that gold record would help. Put your helmet back on. These controls seem to be unlocked now, but I still don't know what they do. Ooh, I think I did something there. Well, at least they have a sense of humor. Force field? On. Hello, Mr. Bull. I'm going to call you Edgar, after an old friend of mine. But don't worry, Edgar. I'm going to bust you out of here. Wow. That really looks delicious all of a sudden. At least they're feeding the poor bull. Rescue? Put our guesses down. Boring! Force field off. Can these guys breathe air? Put your helmet back on. Man, those aliens were into some weird stuff. Come here, Edgar. I wonder if there's some music on that gold record that would help Sasha. This kind of explains why they don't seem too smart. Sasha's right. I'm not 100% sure they're not aliens. Force field on. Did you just turn on the anti-gravity drive? Not on purpose. This is quite a breakthrough. This button looks like it splits atoms. Oh, that never leads to trouble. Oh, Edgar.
What are you who rules this school of fish is what I would like to know. I wonder if playing that gold record would help. This looks like a particle collider, or else, a trash compactor. Ooh, I found a needle in a haystack. I thought that was supposed to be more difficult. Force field off. Boring. Wait, that's where leather comes from? <laughs> what did you think? I don't know. Really tough silkworms? Festive. There will be time for feasting later. That needle looks sharp. Not so tough now, are you? Hey. Hey, it looks like part of an old Victrola. I think I need a turntable to really make this sound system happen. Hey, we got a record player. This party is really getting cooking. You guys, let's give it a party. Why would they send that to the space? Is that a staring contest you aliens are looking for? Is what do you that how you communicate? So be it. Staring contest This track is. doesn't seem to be doing much for Sasha. Is that music? Oh, so beautiful. My mother used to whistle this song out in her garden. Yes, darling. Come back to us. And help us get off the spaceship! Spaceship? <laughs> this thing? Please, haven't you examined the material composition and construction methods? This is obviously just a reproduction alien vehicle. Created by the federal government in order to confuse and panic foreign countries during the arms race. The ocean floor is littered with them. Can we go find Coach Oleander and get out of here then? Yes. Just after this song is over. It's okay. We found everybody. Except for Coach Oleander, who I totally did not forget just now. How are we going to reach Mori without some sort of link? Just find a path using jellyfish or something. Guess I need to find a way out of here. If only there were more fish outside, I could get out of here. Psychically speaking. I can't side-blast anything with my head all messed up like this. Can't split that, I guess. Millions of fish in the sea, but you can never find one when you really need it. Am I right? I wonder if there are any more tracks on this record. Something about this is terrifying. I wonder if that's a lingering effect from my time inside a crow's mind. Maybe I can make a sound that fish like. I wonder what this hmm. is. If you're not going to play that lovely classical piece, Rasputin, could you at least turn it down a little? I said down, not up. 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 Oh my. Is that a whale up there? Whoa! I am so awesome right now. What can you see, darling? The majesty of the undersea kingdom over which I rule with benevolence and wisdom. For I am as great as Poseidon himself. Oh, no. I knew the size would go to his head. Hi, fishy. I see lights up in that cruise ship. I'll bet you that's where Coach Oleander is being held. I hope the Silerium hasn't caused him to... 
revert to bad habits. Like try to take over the world? Oh, that's only one of them, darling. Sounds like there's already music going on in there. Maybe Coach is okay. I see him. How does he look? Are there signs of Silurian poisoning? There are signs of something, all right. Hmm. I can't get in. His mental defenses are probably on high alert. He has always cared so much about defense, darling. Can't side blast anything with my head all messed up like this. Coach's Silurian poisoning looks worse than what you got. The There's play. already music playing, and it's having no effect on him. Or his mental defenses could be causing a sort of mental echo chamber for the Silurian waves, inverting the results of music therapy. So, I should shut off the music? Yes! Yeah. Whatever you can to disrupt his show and put an end to this music. Right. Commencing Operation Buzzkill. Ha <laughs> ha! Yes! Let me hear you make the noise! Oh, whoops. I think Hold that actually made him more down. excited about the show. Keep trying. You can never have this tasteless when you're high, girl. I feel feeling all this. Right. Let's never run this place, people. Oh, rats. You like that, too. Come on! Maybe I should stop. I give up. It's time for big guns. I'm going to focus all my mental energy on you, so you'll have the power to side blast this part of the smithereens. Of course! Why didn't we do that before? Um, no one asked me. My head feels good. Like it wants to blast something. Hey, that glass looks really good. Who's pouring cold water on my shelf? Uh oh. This is good. Help! Somebody! I'm a singer, not a singer. Never. You like my old self again. Help! Somebody! I can't hold on forever! I can't swim! Let the water come from? Science. Which I love, but please stay on track, Rasputin. Sorry. I'm losing my grip. If I only had a giant head to rub these on, I could stick them to the ceiling with static electricity. No time for parlor tricks, Rasputin. Nobody. Just jump down, Coach. Oh, that's right. You can't hear me from here. I can't hold on forever. Hey, is that some sort of meat? Oh. Oh my god! Yeah! I wish the Navy could see me now! <laughs> Can't TK coach when he's all slippery. Can't TK coach when he's all slippery. Thank <laughs> you. 
Coach, you did it! You're swimming! We will tell no one of your moment of fear, nor of your Silerium delusions. Silerium delusions? Does a soldier have to get poisoned to enjoy a little R&R &R around here? Never mind. What we need to do now is focus on getting out of here with Truman. We can get past these mutant fish guards pretty easily. Most of them are pretty harmless and stupid. Mutant fish guards, you say? Yes, aquatic animals grotesquely enlarged and made somewhat ambulatory. I recently collaborated with an individual who had some expertise in that field. You haven't seen any dental equipment lying around, have you? Well, actually, I'm strapped into a chair right now that looks like it could belong to a... dentist. My god. Rasputin, get out of that chair! <laughs> What did the coach mean? Well, see, there was this one time I tried to, uh, take over the world. I got some help from a dentist slash brain surgeon. Slash lunatic? Everybody, shh! What? No one can hear us. Yeah, but I'm just a little freaked out. Where is he? <gasps> Something's wrong with Truman's brain. What? I can't see the end of it. He must have increased the Silerium around it or something. Oh. I still can't pull him out of that thing. What was that? Ah, hello? <gasps> Dr. Lobato! Hey, have I seen you somewhere before? Uh... Because if you're a new patient, then there is a lot of paperwork you'll need to fill out. Didn't you... Weren't you... The coach... Oh, listen. I'd appreciate if you didn't tell that little army man about my second job. As a freelance contractor, I do find the need to... <laughs> Juggle clients from time to time. But I don't think he would like hearing that I was moonlighting. Just between you and me, I think that little fellow had a touch of halitosis. Am I right? But the customer is always right. And it's not like my new client doesn't have his own issues. New client? Who's that? Aha, <laughs> nice try. Doctor-patient confidentiality is something I hold dear. I'd be nothing without my professional ethics. Now, sit back, relax, and this icky procedure will be over in no time. Procedure? I'll be gentle. I have to. I get a bonus if I deliver your brain in one piece. <laughs> Coach Oleander, that mermaid tail, it mono propulsor really. All right, I'm going in. Are you sure about this, Dad? I'm sure this is what a psychonaut would do. Okay, I'm inside Dr. Lobato's mind, and I'm. I'm. on a boat? Am I tied to the mast? Hey, you down there! First mate, what's going on? Why am I tied up? Is a storm coming? There's a monster lurking beneath these waves. A cursed, soulless leviathan that will never rest till it's dragged us down into the black abyss. How about we get the heck out of here then? You think we wouldn't sail to more friendly waters if we could? Look at that compass. Gone. Lost somewhere along the way. It's enough to drive a man. To drive him! <coughs> oh God! He's here! Not ready.
seems to be shock resistant, which is unusual for a sh <laughs> Looks like I did some fire damage. Fire! Why didn't we think of that? Okay, first mate Lovato. If Monstrobato comes back up, do that trick to slow down time again, okay? I'm going to need all the time I can get. I gotta get that helmet off again so I can burn that sh- I can't pull off his helmet. He's got too good a grip on it. <laughs> if I could hold one of these things in the right position, I could probably blast it back into his face. probably blast it back into his face. I can't pull off his helmet. He's got too good a grip on it. Too big and slippery. <laughs> Can't pick up that monster. Way too big and slippery. What are you doing? <laughs> this guy is much tougher in his mind than in reality. seem to be flammable. You think we didn't try that? <laughs> Got it! Hey! I think you did some damage there. <laughs> Not so tough now, are you, shower cat? If we could just ruin this game for you, Maybe he'd give up. <laughs> Bullseye! This guy is much tougher in his mind than in reality.
gotta slow him down, man. I'd rather drown than him. Oh, man. Okay, time for bath fun to be over. Yeah. Moving too fast. I need time to get a TK grip. Dang, it doesn't seem to be flammable. Rare crap. It's moving too fast. I need time to get a TK grip. No good. My side blast is bouncing right off the wood. Ship, the more frustrated he gets. We're trapped. I can't burn a soap. What am I thinking? Dark waters, take me now. Stereoscope, but I don't want to ruin the moment. Okay, now we're getting somewhere. Not sure what this place is, but it feels very private. I think I hit the memory mother load. Bye, son. Bye bye. Have fun at the hospital. I know they'll take good care of you there. The procedure won't hurt a bit. We love you. Why isn't he leaving? Just keep waving. The little monster will give up eventually. Ah, soon we'll be free of this devil child. My colleagues at the hospital. They all agree on the diagnosis and what must be done. Will the procedure hurt him? Well, the ice pick is long, but it's very thin. And in the right hands. Oh, I don't care. I just don't care anymore. Just take him away and let this be over one way or another. Come in here and look if you don't believe me. See? Every spoon! Every spoon bent! But how do you know it was... I caught him red-handed. Wasn't using his hands. <sighs> okay, listen. I'll take him into the hospital with me tomorrow. Have some of the other doctors examine him. We need to be sure. After all, he is our son. Is he? I don't want to use my powers inside this dollhouse. <laughs> Oh, 
Will you look at our little angel? Our perfect boy. So sweet and peaceful. His whole life ahead of him. I can already tell he's going to be a doctor. Just like his old dad. Or an architect. Or a lawyer. Maybe a dentist. God forbid! <laughs> hey! What's this teddy bear doing in his crib? You know, the eyes aren't child safe. Don't look at me. He must have been the cleaning lady. Wait a second. You weren't crazy. You were just... born a psychic. Holy smokes. Hey! The missing compass! So, your parents took you and... they took you and... Oh, man. Lobato, how are you, um, feeling? Like a cavity that's just been filled. I've done terrible things. It's not too late to set things right. Attention, all guards, release the patients. Bring them all here, and then swim home to your little families. There will be no more terrible experiments in this place. Great! Because I'm going to blow it to smithereens! Self-destruct sequence initiated. You've got to be kidding me! Now, there's got to be someone to help. Really, I'm going to find a way out of here, and then we'll all help kill your dad, okay? Hurry, Raz! Sasha, let the record go. We've got to get out of here. Right after right. Warning. Warning. Let me help you through this window, Harold. Harold, where are you going? Warning. The jet! I said the jet! There's Harold. Warning. I hope he doesn't fly off without us. I'm in. Time to take off and leave everyone Warning. else behind. Jeez, take a joke, Harold. Warning. It works. Warning. External Psylock activated. Do not attempt takeoff. What? Warning. Hey, let us go! Warning. Aha! I see the sun. Psylocke deactivated. The jet is cleared for takeoff. Come on, guys! Great work, darling. Self-destruct sequence complete. In T minus ten. Come on, Truman! Nine. Let's go! Eight. Seven. 
Six. We did it. Five. Four. Hey, hey guys. Three. What about me? Don't just leave me here. Two. Guys. One. Detonation. Don't leave. Oh, hey. Relax, darling. We carried your body on board along with Truman. Come on, you think we'd leave a man behind? I also carried Murmory. Sorry, I've been out of my body for a while. Of course, darling, and you were amazing. Now rest your body and your head. We're clear of the rhombus, setting a course for Psychonauts headquarters. Dad, please wake up. I have so much to tell you. Oh. Your boyfriend? It's time that you face That there's no reason why You're drawn to the place Where you're certain to die And didn't you get my Mayday telegram To please stay away In the rhombus of ruin And you'll stick like glue in The rhombus of ruin You're a fool to dare From the rhombus of ruin Cause trouble is brewing So don't put your shoe in You're going to boo-hoo in The rhombus of ruin Thank you. 